Hi guys, welcome back to the Life Skills Kitchen. Today we are going to be cooking and I have Miss James here to help me make some cupcakes. So normally, if I'm gonna make cupcakes, I usually use that box and then frost them with a container of yummy frosting. But today, our recipe wants us to try to make homemade cupcakes. So we're gonna give it a shot. So for the sake of time, Miss James and I have already measured out all of our ingredients. So we're gonna go step by step and show you um, how to combine them to make our cupcakes. So before you start cooking, remember you wanna wash your hands, okay? So get all those germs off. Miss Jody and I have already washed our hands, so we're ready to go. Step one wants us to turn on the oven to uh, 350 degrees. So remember, anytime you're using the oven, you need to ask mom or dad or have an adult there to help you, okay? Because it's very hot and you don't wanna burn yourself. So our oven is set to 350 degrees, and then we're gonna take our cupcake muffin tins here. You can do one of two things. You can either um, put the cupcake wrappers in each of these, or you can use your spray to spray each one so they, the cupcakes don't stick to it. So we went ahead and done that step already. All right, we're gonna take our bowl, and Miss James is gonna help me here. She is going to add our flour, our sugar, baking powder, and the salt. And she's going to use this whisk to mix it together, okay? So she's gonna combine all those ingredients in the bowl. It's pretty good. Good deal. So um, we have some butter here. We're going to go ahead and put this on our mixer. James, you let me know when you're ready to go there. Okay. I am ready. All right, so now we've cut our butter, and Miss Summer's trying to get a few more pieces cut here. Um, and she's going to, for step four, cut our um, butter into tablespoons, and then we're going to add one piece at a time and mix it on low speed. So Miss James, as you are ready, you can go ahead and turn that on to low speed. and then go ahead and start adding one piece of butter to our uh, bowl at a time. So this is gonna take about a minute and it says that it's gonna look kind of like sand once it all gets mixed in together. Summer and Miss James really like chocolate cupcakes. These are not going to be chocolate, but that's our favorite. Chocolate cupcakes and chocolate icing. Do you guys have a favorite cupcake flavor? You'll have to comment below and let us know. mixer out just a little bit getting that butter mixed in. There it goes. Our butter is getting stuck here so we're just going to help it out. Let's get closer. While she's doing that, I've already done this, but you're going to take your eggs and crack your eggs. So you might need help with cracking your eggs. Sometimes um, those are hard to do, but we have our eggs cracked and ready to go for step five once this is all mixed in. Yeah, 
one more piece here. Make sure that butter is getting all mixed in with that flour. And this ever is a little messy when I end up cooking. And I think this is probably the longest step that there is. So just making sure that butter is mixed with all that flour and sugar. So just to help it out, we're going to, I'm going to turn it off here and just, I'm going to take a big spoon and make sure that's all mixed up underneath there. We have a little bit kind of stuck to the side of the bowl. It sure does look like sand, doesn't it? Yummy. 
move these things out of the way. This is where I think it's ready. All right. Miss Jody thinks it's ready. We're gonna go ahead and take that off, that bowl off. this up so here's our mix right there doesn't that look delicious so now we want to take this mix and put in our cupcake tins to make our cupcakes so we're going to use a measuring cup a one-third cup right here we're going to scoop a full cup into I'll have to pass it on to Miss Jody um, into our muffin tins so hopefully we get a full pan here This is the first time I've ever made homemade cupcakes here. How about you, Miss Jody? Too, first time. I'm excited. It looks like it might actually make a few more than what we have room for, so we can make more after this pan. Two more to go and then we are going to put this in the oven now this step you're gonna to have to have an adult help you with because remember our oven was set to 350 degrees so right now it is really hot okay so make sure you have mom or dad or an adult help you we are going to smooth those out get that part off we're gonna take these yummy delicious mix that we just made and put it in the oven for about 20 minutes we're gonna stick a toothpick in it and see if um, it comes out clean then that means our cupcakes are cooked all the way through so we will be back with um, the, the cooked cupcakes here in just a little bit. Oh, one other thing before we go, make sure you set your timer. I have a timer here. You can also use your phone or a watch, but you wanna set it for 20 minutes. So that way you know to check them in 20 minutes to make sure they don't overcook. Okay, so uh, Miss Jody and I will be back in about 20 minutes and show you what our cupcakes look like. 